possible for us three to make a, a car show and then put it on the television. <laughs> Who here thinks that would be a good idea? They've got shows on the television. That woman bakes a cake. That goes on forever. Then there's that program where they look at a hedge and go, Badger, there's a Badger. I saw a bloke playing golf on television. Well, how long for It's all day, just playing golf. Oh, really? On the TV. Well, do you know what? I was watching the television the other day and there was a bloke on it. And do you know what he was talking about? What? The weather. Well, stupid. And yet there's no program where somebody drives around the corner in a bright green Lamborghini in a cloud of tire smoke going, Power! Uh, uh. And I think there should be. Yeah, yeah. So we thought, yeah, I think it's a good idea. It's not bad. So we yes. thought, we'd give it a go. We tried reviewing cars on the television. Yes. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. So what we did is we booked a racetrack and then we agreed that we'd each of us turn up in a loud, fast GT car and find out which one was best. Yeah, but it turns out that actually, if you've never done it before, which we haven't, being a television presenter is really difficult, as you shall see. I was very excited to try my hand at being a television presenter, so I was the first to arrive. This is a Porsche 911. I've never been a fan of the Porsche 9. I've never been a fan of the Porsche 911 when it was the 993 or the 996 or the 997. But this is the 911 91991 991 And um, the engine, the engine is now cooled by water rather than the air. Oh, here comes Richard Hammond now in the Chevrolet Corvette Z06. This is the new Mercedes-Benz AMG GTS, which replaces the old Mercedes-Benz AMS SLS. It's smaller, it's cheaper, it has a much smaller engine, but with two turbochargers, but it doesn't make as much power. And most interestingly, the gullwing doors that it used to have, have gone, and it now has normal doors. <laughs> but on paper, it doesn't seem to be any slower. I like that a lot, but I wonder if it's as good as the, uh, as the 911991. <laughs> I'm in the Z06, the latest and fastest Corvette. And the Corvette has always been the latest and fastest car in America. We're going to do a drag race now um, and see which of the cars is the fastest for a quarter of a mile. Um, over, over. First I read the engine. Because you do that on the television. I've pushed all the buttons here which make, makes, makes the car faster and bumpier. James didn't start. I, I don't know why. Right. What what happened? It's no good not putting it in D, otherwise it doesn't know to go, it just revs. Ah. Back at the beginning line, the producer reminded us that in the race it was our job to impart useful information about the cars. Up 
lose it. I lost. <laughs>